assalamu alaikum students student of class matric as previously i had uh, read this poem for you and uh, as well as explained it to you now in this uh, lecture i'll provide you the notes of uh, that poem that is the nation a nation strength first of all it's a central idea in this poem emerson has described the secret of the greatness of nation he says that the secret of the greatness of nation does not lie in money and gold only the people of a country can make a nation strong they are the people who can suffer long for the sake of honor and truth lazy and easy going people cannot serve their country only hard working and courageous people can contribute to the nation of a strength of a nation sincere and brave persons can build the foundation of their country now put the heading of question and answers question number 1 who has written the poem and what is the message of this poem this poem has been written by rolf waldo emerson full stop the wealth of a nation lies in men who make who make it great and strong wealth does not make a nation powerful men alone fight for the cause of honor and truth they never care for personal personal loss they lay down the foundation of their nation very deep and strong they raise its pillar very high their courage and noble deeds glorify their nation question number 2 what makes a nation great and strong question mark and the answer is material wealth does not make a nation great and strong only men can make a nation really strong only people have the tendency to make a nation pillars deep and lift them to the sky fields are won by those who believe only in winning question number 3 what type of people can make a nation great and strong what kind of men can lift their country to the sky question mark and the answer is the following types of people are needed to make a nation strong number 1 men who can stand for the sake of truth men who can suffer long for the sake of honor number 3 men who can work while others sleep next men can rear while others fly next is men with courage and noble deeds men with strong state of mind and positive thoughts question number 4 write five sentences about character and the answer is character is the most important part of personality full stop a person with a good character is responded by all good character consists of strong will power the main aim of acquiring education is character building if character is lost everything is lost it is a mirror of our deeds now come to the blanks number 1 is a nation's strength was written by dash over here i have miss underlined uh, students you just uh, underline ralph waldo emerson number second he was born in 1803 it is underlined he died in 1882 it is underlined 1882 is the blank okay number fourth not gold comma but only men can make so men is underlined number fifth 
Dash was an American poet. So Ralph Waldo Emerson, it is underlined. Number six, beside a poet, comma, he was also an essayist and philosopher. Essayist is underlined. Now come to reference to contest. Now jot it down. Brave man who work while others sleep. Who dare while others fly. They build a nation, pillars deep and lift them to the sky. Question number one. Mention the name of a poem and poet. Poem name is A Nation's Strength and the poet is Ralph Waldo Emerson. Question number two, what, may, what type of men work for the country? Brave men work for their country. Number third is how these men can build a nation pillars deep. Answer is these men can work very hard for their country. Development and prosperity in this way they lift their country to the sky. So students, you have to go through this poem, just read the poem carefully, listen to my uh, all of the three lectures regarding this poem and copy it down, the question and answer, blanks and everything in your literature copies and student, you have to visit the school on Wednesday between 9 to 12 timing. Okay, we will be available over there for you, for your assistance, if you need any type of help and you have to bring your complete copies in the, on that day, your correction will be done, assignment will be given to you, worksheet will be given to you for the, as a type of homework and that homework should be done by your own self. And you have to make a file of that homework and you have to maintain it weekly. For example, in this month we will uh, give you four uh, weekly homework. Four days in a week you have to visit the school for correction, for assignment, for taking the homework. So, you have to maintain a file and put that... Uh, homework in that file and maintain it and visit the school uh, between the these timing and follow the SOPs um, according to the government rule that is you have to wear the mask no one is allowed to you if you are without the mask gatekeeper will not allow you and uh, if you need any help you can ask us we all the teachers are available over there in the school in these timing and uh, Wednesday is the day of ninth and metric classes so you have to be with the uh, with us on Wednesday on uh, rest of the days they those days are divided according to the class wise so kindly come on your own day and ask us if you are having any query regarding this we will help you out, we will guide you, we will be there, We all of you will be there for your assistance. So kindly visit uh, between 9 to 12 timing with complete SOPs on Wednesday. I hope so you have understood my lecture. Stay blessed and stay healthy. Allah Hafiz.